year 1970, the personal VHS was invented, the floppy disk was invented, and the Beatles officially split up. And in 1970, in Auckland, New Zealand, there was a renowned paint chemist by the name of Frank Aiken Smith. That is Mr. F. A. S. Frank decided to start making some colourful art paints in his home garage and start selling them to art shops and stationery stores throughout New Zealand. Frank found that his paint sold really well and the demand grew. So in January 1971, Frank went to the registry office to register his company, Frank Aiken Smith, but changed his mind to call his company Fine Art Supplies. So in January 1971, Fine Art Supplies was born. In the 1970s, the New Zealand Education Department was setting up quality control standards for some of the items that were used in New Zealand schools. They include exercise books like the 1B5, rulers, erasers, folders, school furniture, and paint was to be no exception for these quality controls. The New Zealand Education Department met with fine art supplies to discuss these standards. The Education Department were looking to set some quality standards for the paints that were used in New Zealand schools. They were looking for two types of paint to be used in the schools, but they must meet the standards that they set. They were looking for two types of paint, one for younger students that is washable and a permanent paint for the senior students. None of the paints that were currently available to New Zealand schools in the 1970s met these standards. Fine Art Supplies set about formulating the two paints that would meet the standards required. Super Tempera, preschool and primary school paint was born. Student Acrylic, Intermediate and secondary school paint was born. These two paints were instantly approved. Fast quickly became the number one paint used by New Zealand schools. Forty years later, Fast are still the top selling brand of paints used in New Zealand schools. Although these standards were only in use for a short time, they set the bar high for only high quality paints, inks and dyes to be used in New Zealand schools. In the 1980s, FAS continued to work with education departments. FAS and the Auckland College of Education filmed a series of documentaries for new teachers in Teachers College. These documentaries were based on the skills of working with art paints and children in the classroom. Judy introduces the children to paint and materials before they begin their portrait. And the children are given primary colours on a palette, one brush and one sponge, and they're shown step by step how to warm up the colours. So the children first have just a painting mixing session. They're just putting colour in and trying to see how much colour they can put onto the page, how many colours they
Fine art supplies have always been innovative with new products. One of these products is creating a paint that will wash from all kids' school clothing. It's called Total Wash, a world first for school paints. Over the years, FAS has continued to work closely with teachers, artists and educational groups to make fine art paints, inks and dyes that are easy to use in the classroom. FAS Fine Art Supplies have always been committed to creating a fine art painting experience for students and children in the classroom. Today, Fine Art Supplies exports its fine art painting experience 